Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 6510 in Candy Crush Saga. If you find these videos helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. So, 25 moves, 113 jelly. Of course, it's just not straightforward. We've got cutouts, candy cane fences, marmalade, licorice locks, rainbow twists, toffee, sugar chess, which means we have sugar keys, uh, portals, and then on the good side we have bobbers if we can get some nice combos, and we do have wrapped candy dispensers. So let's see what we can do with all this. Let's see if we can try to get more purple. Oh, there we go. We got a wrapped. Now notice that these all came together and this one is separate. If I can get this one unlocked, it can join the others, and then if I just hit this twice, Bingo, we're done with all of them. It's not likely to happen, but it's it's a goal worth pursuing if it can be managed. Oh, I'd love to put those two together. Here we've got a key. All right, so now those four got taken out before this, but I'm not too worried about that. I like that we got the bobber. <gasps> I could do a wrapped, but I think I can do a striped wrapped combo. And the beauty of this striped wrapped combo is I can reach three bobbers. Three bobbers means at least nine fish because I'm using a combo. And combos send out three fish each. So that really helps to send out a whole school of fish. Let's collect a key and make a stripe all at the same time. Look at that, the bobber is getting hit. I could hit the bobber again. I would love to do it as a combo instead. Let's see what can be managed. But the stripes are handy on their own anyway. They really do help get all the way through the various layers of the toffee. Uh, so yeah, let's set off stripes and open this up. Okay, let's look at what we've got on the board. We only have four colors. This is the point in time where I really need to figure out how to get the combos going. And one way to do that often is to take out a color that isn't very prevalent. Right now that might be orange, so I could take out this orange or I could move this purple because it actually removes something. <sighs> You know, the orange doesn't make an immediate difference. Let's do this. Now let's take out the orange. Okay, there we go. So now we've got a wrapped. I can make a stripe over on this side. Not terribly helpful at this point, but it might pair up with something. Got a wrapped candy over here. I don't know. This brings the green down. That doesn't look right. I think I'm going to do this. Okay, let's hit a couple of bobbers and try to reposition things. I can do this. That doesn't look spectacular. I can do this. That would blow this up in a spot that's not really great. So I think I'm going to do this and go for some cascading. Yeah. All right, can I get things together? Oh, I'm making stripes. I'm just not putting things where I want them. All right, let's do this. So we're going to send out 333. Three, three. I could do a wrapped wrapped. If it were down here, I would definitely do wrapped wrapped. It would take out a lot. But let's go ahead and do this. So now, finally, the fish are making it so we can get into this area. Do you see the wrapped wrapped? That's a good spot for it. Not great, but good. And we've even gotten some of this removed. But this is going to hit these two bobbers. Should I do other things beforehand? I really like that stripe. <sighs> I don't want to lose this. I think this is going to have some value for the board. There we go. Is it enough? No, I don't think so. I don't think I can get 10 more per turn, especially when you look at the fact that not only are some of these double thick, but some of these are double thick under double thick toffee. So we just didn't get that firepower that I was hoping for. It was those combos. 
I wasn't able to successfully put together the combos. And I'm not sure if it was because... I don't think it was the board. I think it was me. And I'm not sure if it's because I started too late or when I did start, I just didn't have the patience to really look at it. So I'm going to try better to look at it. I'll pause the recording. I will come back with a new board. I'm going to have the microphone turned off, but then once I figure this out, I'll come back and let you know about how many tries it took and I'll narrate it for you. Okay, so got this one done on the second try. And I'd love to say it's because I learned a lot, but look at this opening salvo. I just got so lucky here. I got a lot of things to happen all at once. We opened things up super quickly and now look at this. Striped wrapped combo. That can really open up the base plus send out a lot of fish. I still have a little bit of that uh, rainbow twist. If I get rid of that then I'm closer to the action. Oh, color bomb. Oh, I really want that but I don't have a lot of orange. I need more orange, but I'm risking everything, aren't I? Okay, this is too risky. Oh no, the fish could eat anything. Phew, I'm going to take this now. I have to. I can't risk that again. It was probably foolish to risk it in the first place because my feeling that there wasn't enough orange low to the ground, well, there's nothing low to the ground. That orange wrapped combo helped us get closer to the ground though. So now we've just got a lot of layers of stuff. I keep hitting that center area, but it's wrapped up in a key. I need to get that last key collected. No key yet. Oh, oh, there's a key. And there's the key collected. So now if a fish hits that center or a stripe hits that center, we're good. I like this move. It hits the bobber. It hits things directly. That's what we're looking for, getting direct hits so that the fish don't have as much to do when we send them out. Um, let's go combo if we can. Ooh, nice. Because we also exploded a wrapped candy. So now there's that one on the left-hand side that, oh, there we go. Fish just got it. It's got several layers. So we take out a little on our own. I want to get that stripe. Oh, let's see if I can combo things. Striped wrapped or wrapped wrapped? Oh, striped wrapped, definitely. It has broader reach and it's going to go down to the bottom and hit all of those jelly. And there we go. We got a couple rounds of the fish, so that's how I do it. And I thought that one was kind of fun because I had a really good start. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned, but that was my second playthrough. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put those below. I hope good luck comes to you quickly. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.